Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to my channel, Eat Healthy, Get Rich, Drink Good Beer. Today, I have a fantastically easy to make anti-aging salad. It is suitable for vegetarians and also for non-vegetarians. So these are whole moons. I have soaked them in water overnight, then using an aerated container, and then I covered it with the wet cloth. And then after another 24 hours, again with the wet cloth. It sounds a lot of work, it is not. It actually just takes few seconds. That's the result here, guys. So these are trout moon. As some of you know, in my day job, I am an aging biologist. What I'm trying to do in the lab is trying to reverse aging. One of the ways you can actually reverse aging, especially in mice, is by circulating the young systemic blood into old mice. So those experiments are called parabiosis. So the young blood rejuvenates the old mice. There are companies in America actually exploiting this idea, transferring young plasma into older people and seeing whether they can reverse the aging diseases such as Alzheimer's. Dracula was right. So these moons are sprouted and they are kind of embryogenic. So it's actually really, really healthy to eat these. Many, many things are optional. So you need red pepper, cucumber, mozzarella cheese, red apple will give us sweet punch, lettuce, fresh coriander, tomatoes, and boiled eggs. This is optional. You can skip boiled eggs. You can also add green chili if you want for the punch, ground cumin, black ground pepper, salt, and extra virgin olive oil. Great, some lemon zest. I'm gonna just basically add everything in. Squeeze the lime, salt, Ground cumin, ground black pepper, extra virgin olive oil, mix. Look at that. Honestly, there is very minimal effort in this. This is your anti-aging salad. Let it sit for 10 minutes in the fridge. In the meantime, the magic is working. Let's talk about the stocks. The stock I want to introduce today is again from these broad themes, which I have introduced many, many weeks ago. We will pick one from the clean energy, and then we will also pick two coins from the blockchain and Elite fields. Just be very, very careful with this, guys, because there are so many coins out there. You need to really plan your entry and exit very, very carefully. The reason why you lose money in stocks and especially in crypto is because you become greedy. You take out that calculator, you start multiplying how many coins you have, how much money you have, and then that that's the downfall of you. I'm not a financial advisor. These videos are for entertainment purposes only. Do not trust anyone online. The stock I want to talk today about uh, is actually uh, also in, in the blockchain sector as well. And I'll talk about it in a second. It is ILUS, ILUS International. It's a merger and acquisition company. They have four subsidiaries, the eRaptor, FB Technologies, Fireberg and TVC. They have fully autonomous firefighting uh, equipment, EV vehicles uh, and the technology. The current share price is only 0.11. Most of the penny stocks we pick around 0.10 to 0.30 range. We usually have a price target of $1. I would say that this is uh, end of 2021 and I'll explain my reasons for this. Again, do not marry a stock. So the moment you hit 100%, you take your initial investment off and the rest can run on house. Um, risk management, usually I would put 10 to 15%, but for this particular stock i'm not putting any stop loss but that doesn't mean you shouldn't please be very careful err on the side of caution rather than aggression the market cap is only 132 million authorized share are 2 billion outstanding are 1.1 billion the float is only 342 million short interest is medium to high the company has a really ambitious uh, ceo so what are the main uh, catalysts? Most of the companies in this penny land say, oh, we're going to uplist to the major exchange, blah, blah, blah. But I do think they are serious. So they want to uplist to OTCQB, but also uh, maybe Nasdaq in the near future. Uh, they have this firefighting uh, vehicles, uh, in which are electronic. Uh, so I can well imagine that many, many countries will want to upgrade their fire services. The fire trucks, the fire engines, they're all diesel and petrol. They are into AI space. They say that artificial intelligence technology will be integrated into some of the, the firefighting drones. I think this is quite interesting because if they can uh, manage to acquire a revenue generating companies in Q2, Q3, I, I do feel that uh, a good uh, announcement can push this share price up. They are in talks with a German uh, unmanned aerial firefighting drone company. And the final uh, catalyst is that they have announced uh, cryptocurrency. They are saying they're going to introduce the ILS coin. Although the CEO has been very, very clear that they are not a crypto company. Uh, they will just partner with another company to generate a coin. Average volume has been decent. It's been 42 million and they have a very active Twitter profile. In the OTCQB vault, you need companies that are actually very clear with shareholders and they keep informing. The thing that pushed me to make this video is this uh, tweet yesterday, which was basically saying that in one commercial kitchen, they have this uh, firefighting technology where they can actually uh, shut the fire in really 60 seconds. And this was uh, in McDonald's and I can see if, if they announce any further uh, contracts, government 
contracts, uh, firefighting contracts, e-vehicle contracts, uh, obviously this thing can reach to the moon. Another sign of a company growing is when they are looking to recruit more people. So recently they appointed a uh, marketing uh, director, lead the ongoing global uh, marketing campaign. They are also looking to hire more people, again suggesting they have money to hire people. Last week we talked about safe mark coins, so let's just have a quick look at the chart. Again it is uh, behaving like a, a classical cryptocurrency, so you have really massive pump here, then dump followed by dump. We got on here, again massive pump and now it is being dumping but I can see it uh, reversing again. So continuing on this theme of new cryptocurrencies, I recently came across Elon Gate. Guys, uh, I only make uh, one video a week. If I buy something, I do immediately tell my subscribers on Twitter. So I, I did buy it on 8th of April. I was about to take my initial investment off, but they announced that they have donated 75,000 to the Children's International. So guys, when they launched this ad, uh, they, got, they want to do charitable uh, business using blockchain. Blockchain is solving so many problems. Uh, I, I actually never thought that someone can think about blockchain solving world hunger. I thought it's a good cause. So I only like 3.3 .3 BNB in it, you know. Uh, guys, to buy, uh, you need Binance and you need uh, Trust Wallet. I'll leave a link in the description if you don't have a Binance account and you will get some discount on buying cryptocurrency. So what is Elongate? It is a, basically a meme. <laughs> it really is a meme coin. So Elon Musk tweeted that if there is a scandal about me, please call it Elongate. <laughs> So, so these guys <laughs> made a cryptocurrency out of it, but again, it's just going crazy. Uh, if you look at the chart, uh, we got in here. I had a chance to take my money off here, but I, I didn't. I only have like 0.3 BNB, so I'll, I'll just let it run. Can you just imagine uh, the current price is 0 0.602 something, but imagine if they can shave off two or three zeros. <laughs> Honestly, it will be worth it. So every cryptocurrency, again, they went up pumped up, sold, coming down, going back up. Again, I think it's gonna follow uh, the other cryptocurrencies. There is no cryptocurrency on the planet that is not volatile. Again and again, I tell you, you need to plan your entry and you need to plan your exit. The thing is, I have like five or six of these altcoins. If one of them performs really well, I'll recover all the losses on other coins. So I'm not worried about it, uh, but I only can suggest that you uh, have a quick look uh, at, at this cryptocurrency. I also have a very active Twitter, 13.4K followers. They have also good followers on other social media. A few days ago, I tweeted that uh, they have donated this money and then uh, I have already uh, to x my money, but I didn't take it out. But <laughs> they responded to my tweet saying 70K was just warming up. <laughs> now I understand uh, what they meant because, and guys, eight hours ago, they announced a surprise party. So donation and giveaway, 12 p.m. noon Eastern Standard Time. And guys, that news is that they have just donated 250,000 against hunger. Uh, they have donated 250,000 for ocean cleanup and they have also uh, put 250,000 in a special wallet for other charitable donations and other charitable partners. I don't know an organization. They, that's close to 1 billion donations, guys, for a token that's two, three weeks old to donate to so many big charities. Tell me a government organization that has been successful in doing this. Tell me any other charitable organization that has been able to do this. Tell me any religious organization who has been able to do this. If this is going in the right direction, I don't think I'm gonna take my initial investment off. I can let this uh, token run for many, many, many years. It's also, it's a deflationary token. That means basically when anyone sells, they actually burn a proportion of tokens down and that will intrinsically increase the value of token holders. And here we go. So they have burnt 855 billion tokens already. Just think about those zeros before the token price. The moment those zeros go down to few zeros, I don't think there is any stock that's gonna increase in valuation like this. And of course, this is all for good causes. So they have my full support. Even after all of these uh, donations, literally a few hours ago, they said, we promise this is still nothing compared to our vision. Guys, instead of donating to random charities and random religious places, and random government people. I don't know. I think blockchain is, is the way to go. For me, this is my personal choice. Do your own research. As you know, these videos are for entertainment purposes only. I might actually buy more rather than taking my initial out. It's for donation. It's for charity. If you look at many, many cryptocurrencies, they started at this uh, level. And even if they reach 0 .0001, uh, we will have made quite a lot of money. At the same time, we are uh, supporting a good cause. So that's pretty much it, guys. Let's check on the anti-aging salad. And just eat it!